Hello again, folks. Me again, the British reporter from across the pond. Uh, one of my viewers requested that I do a story uh, about parking cars in America. So I figured I should do some research on the topic first. So far, this is what I got. Andy Miller, a sergeant with Smyrna Police Department's Traffic Unit. And we're out here today on this glorious day in Smyrna. And behind me, you'll see one of the problems we have in Smyrna is people parking on the grass. We ask you to beach in Hampton and doesn't have a driveway. So he's in parking on the grass of his front lawn. It's not always easy to find a place to park it in. Plus, like I said, every... to the way you park near your home. Starting July 1st, people can no longer park on their front lawns if street parking is available. Yeah, city leaders say the request came from concerned citizens wanting to improve the appearance of neighborhoods. But Coral News team, city leaders are considering making it illegal for you to park your car on the grass. They call it an issue of community values. Community. Okay, that is from America's corporate media. Now, Let's ask the regular man on the street. Excuse me, miss. Please tell me what you think of people who park on the grass. You talking to me. You want to know what I think. First of all, I think you're a dumbass for wearing that mask and think you have no class if you park on the grass. Uh, excuse me, sir. Please tell me what you think of people who park on the grass. Please don't ask stupid questions. Everybody here in Texas knows that only low-class parks on the grass. Now get a life, mister.